What up channel, it's 4Play and this is quick competitive clip number 17. In this clip is Dome CTF and I'm going to show you how to block spawns. For those of you that know how to do it, then definitely skip over this one, but some of you guys don't. Blocking spawns has been used for a long time now. Which The benefits of blocking spawn is so everyone doesn't spawn far away on like a CTF map. You want them to spawn in blue because if they spawn in blue, they can't pull that way. So you're going to notice in this clip, I wanted to have time to be able to talk to you, so I started it a little bit late. But I'm gonna actually going to die here and I wanted to show you when I spawn up, I'm going to turn around and nade the wall. That nade is going to cancel the spawn to where my teammate can't spawn there and it's going to force his spawn inside blue. This trick has been used from top pros to top ams and a lot of people know about it. Right here you see me turn, nade the wall because I know my teammate's about to spawn and then I'm going to show you why my teammate spawns on the other side of the map because of that. As you'll notice in the clip, I'll try to do the best I can camera work here, Steven Spielberg status. You're going to see me nade the wall right there. Let's rotate out over here. Bring it over this way. And I'm going to show you how Sidrock is now going to spawn over there. Because he would have spawned underground with me, but he's not going to now. There Sidrock spawns. And that's how you block the spawns in MW3. Make sure you find out when your team is spawning by either pressing the back button or asking your teammates, when are you up, when are you up. Either way, this has been 4Play from Team Envious and the 4Play gang. Peace.